At the Gallery Felici on East 56th Street, one can stroll among Oliver's paintings, pastels, and drawings with owner Felici Ballet. She and her husband Roland were among the first to bring his talent to the attention of the art world. Felici has showed me uh, how to just work, you know, I mean, for the sake of art and society. It's not only mine no more. It's hard to, you know, accept, but in the giving is, is the whole struggle. I think as much as I've influenced Oliver's life, I think he's influenced mine an awful lot, too. In the way I think, in the way I look at paintings, in the way I feel about people, Oliver, when he does people, really, they are people that become alive. They're not just stagnant things on a canvas. And you feel them, and you feel their life, and they become a part of you. And I know many people who have bought his paintings and live with them every day, and they feel that these people in the paintings have become part of their family. I noticed that all masters and all artists, meaning not just painters, suffer. And so, like the football players say, no pay, no gain. So I'm learning, too, that. You know, I'm learning that spirit. And I think that's the spirit of an artist, of a master's. And that's the spirit of Oliver Johnson.